Hey everyone, welcome to another video. So this one's more of a, a show off for what I've been working on because I know that a lot of you have the template for the, the GDXR UVR template and there's a few bugs in there at the minute. But if you bear with us, I am working on some new content and I kind of want to show that off now. So one thing I've done is if you've used a template in the past is I've rebuilt the hand snapping and grab system. So we no longer use this blueprint here. We actually use the skeletal mesh component and what that allows us to do is just take the actor, or in this case a mesh, it's just a ladder that has the climbable preset, and then it's got hands that we've placed on there. So it's just a component that we can add now, and it works for weapons as well. So weapons, we can just add a component, and you can also see here that we have it now so we can actually detect multiple grab components based on whereabouts they're assigned. So in this case, I have a grab component for barrel, which is parented to the grip. And then in there it has two children, which is the hand skeleton meshes, left or right. Same as the bolt slider, which I'll get to in a minute. And then the grab slider is also on there as well. So this grab component could be an actual attached to that one, but we don't need to do that right now. So what that allows us to do is basically rework all of the grab component and remove a whole bunch of two-handed grab code logic because what I've done is I've went into the player so VR character controller Manny and I've rebuilt the whole grabbing interaction system so we detect uh, child, child actors rather than just the actual one that's attached to the weapon so what that lets us do now is if we drop in we can put the headset on Can then get our hands to show up we can see where they are and then if we grab these so the pistols for example only have the component there's no code logic enabled in there it just detects whether it's a left or right hand based on the grip and it assigns the actual interaction I'll do more videos on this in the future and I'll do some tutorials on how to set this all up but the one thing that I wanted to show off and I'm really happy about is on with this new system we've actually got the ability to grab different parts of the gun. So here I can grab the front, but if I grab the slider, I can actually rack that back and then grab it and then go through it as well. So I don't have the hand switching sorted out just yet, but it allows us to actually interact with different elements and then have more, more solid interactions based on weapons and anything else as well. So this is the bit that I want to show off. I'm really excited about it. It's been a lot of fun to work on. It's took about two weeks overhaul to actually build this properly. But you can see that it's a little bit jittery based on distance, but I'm working on it. And that'll be in the next update as well as a whole bunch of fixes regarding the, sp the smooth rotation, which was in there. We've got the height stuff, that's all fixed now. And then I'll be fixing a whole bunch of other stuff with the teleport pads. But it's kind of just a little update that I want to give you and show you that I am working on it. We're doing the, pretty much a big overhaul and it's a lot more interactive and snappy. So I hope you guys are looking forward to it. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you in the next one. Because this has been very exciting. I'm going to get back to it. Bye.